Hey everybody, today I'm in a 2016 Sprinter van. This isn't any ordinary Sprinter van. This is actually a Sprinter RV. So they did a really good job with it. I want to show you around the inside and the outside and point out all the features or flaws that we have because it's honestly really cool what they did with it. And it's uh, a really awesome design and it'd be nice for any of you travel enthusiasts, any tiny home enthusiasts, anybody who just wants a really good deal on a pre-owned RV. Uh, this is a really great time to get this. Uh, so let's let's start with the front cabin here. I'll point out the mileage and all of that. So with our steering wheel here, we have controls on either side. We have beautiful silver accents. This is all wrapped in plastic for durability. We come into our dashboard here. You can see we only have 45,500 or 45,055 miles on it. And then you can also see we have digital display of time and what driving mode you're in. You can see we have our master power switch, light options, uh, our windows, very, very large, massive windows. Of course, our really large mirrors, and you have that uh, smaller, closer up mirror. We have a beautiful wood trim. We have tan throughout as our main color. When we come to our main console here, this couldn't even act like a mirror, hello. Well, we have this great uh, setup here, Sears XM, radio, uh, you can have HDMI, all of the, the good stuff. And we have our climate control options here. We even have heated seats, which is always the best. We have lane assist. I know these big vehicles can be really intimidating to get into. And so that's a great feature. We have our shifters right here covered in that beautiful wood. Uh, more of those switches that you need. This is our key and you have all your little keys as well. Tons of storage throughout. That's gonna be a main thing that you'll see. So much storage, we have cup holders, or even if you wanna be super creative and spunky, these can even be food bowls for your pets. I'm not sure what the previous owners used them as for. It goes either way. As you do have, as you can see, cup holders on your doors as well. So. Wrapped in leather, we have our tan color here. We have beautiful wood uh, piping throughout. You can choose to have your armrests. Got some more storage, got our visors, everything that you could possibly need. Now let's take a look, let's swing back around. And you can see our, our cabin. So we have ventilation throughout. We even have two more seats for any passengers that you bring along with you. All of your safety things, this is your traditional sprinter door here. They put some of this nice privacy comfort padding on as well, but that can open up as well if uh, you have guests or you choose not to exit through the driver's side or passenger side. We have all of our media controllers and we have a cabinet here and you can see the nice thing about these, these hinges are really awesome. This door is staying up by itself, so I don't have to hold it open and angle around. This stays up by itself and also has these lock things. You'll see that in every single storage cabinet that we have that there's locks on it. You can see that I had to tug on it a little bit. We have our, our electrical system and all our breakers, anything you need. This can also be some storage if you like. It's pretty cool. And then you can lock this into place by pushing that button in. We see above here, be careful uh, coming down to the cabin if you're coming from the main. This is a little low and you can hit your head, so deck when you're coming by. But we have JL Audio speakers, super deep storage. It looks like previous owners left some stuff here for you that they didn't want to take. Lights throughout. Awning. You can see those are the controls. We even have a power switch. We'll go outside, but the awning is right along here. We have tons of drawers that has the same mechanism where you push the button and see those locks. So when you're moving, it's not opening and closing all around, throwing your stuff around. Very deep drawers. It's also nice because these can tuck away and you won't hit them when you're walking by since it is a little bit of a smaller space. So same dealio, we have the same amazing hinges, cabinet work, beautiful dark brown cabinetry, goes all the way around. 
it's so much storage i think this is honestly plenty of storage for all your needs we have a little electric burner right here a lovely beautiful large window and even got a plenty of counter space you have a tiny sink you can see they left rv toilet treatment here so it's just sitting there and uh we have a mini fridge which is actually not that mini this is really large and you got your trash can built in you can choose to use this another way if you'd like that's nice the trash isn't rolling around more so you, we can see we have four cabinets just light around here we got the one up the front one over there that's the bathroom we'll get to that and we got another large cabinet right here you can see just how deep it is more controllers we got our convertible bed back here so this is if you have a crazy ton amount of people you got your seat belts of course to keep them safe but this will convert into your bed you got charging ports cup holders you got the tv this is on that cool hinge thing where you can move it around you got our windows with the the vents that you can open up to get some fresh air in here we've got our temperature control you even got a microwave in here our ac right up here you can see our cute little recess lighting very deep this could be used for uh you can see the rod there it could be used for a little mini closet and even have storage down under there for maybe the things like shoes or things you don't access too much then we have a, actually a very large uh bathroom so this is an all-in-one wet room you can see we have our toilet this is not a composting toilet i uh, don't know on the top of my head what it is but it acts as like it you can flush it so that's nice for a lot of people's preferences. You have your toilet paper in here that gets covered so it doesn't get wet by the shower, of course. You can take this off so you can clean babies or pets or whatever you need. You got that, even out of the clothing line to put an extra shower curtain or dry some clothes. You got your vent up here, you got lights in here. But this is nice and easy to clean. And you can see if I push these, and I can just use my foot for the bottom one you can even open up the side so it's super easy cleaning super easy to access it of course that's an option then we have a mirror here so you can put like for our females or males that like to do makeup just put the makeup here you got your mirror you can see how you're looking in the morning that's really nice to have that built in as well and all nice and tucked away in that beautiful brown wood I think they did a really great job with this. So much room. I know RVs, especially on the outside, it really does not look that impressive. Like you wouldn't think it's as much room as there is in here, but there's quite a bit. So let's hop on the outside. All right, so you can see it from the outside. We have our two chairs here. You can see how tall the ceilings are. I'm 5'1", easily fit in, of course, but even our six footers and a little taller, they can fit easily. Got a large running board to get in and out. Very, very large wheels, not your traditional sprinter van wheels. You can see our awning up top and the controls are inside. We have a spare tire in the back. You can see these cases a lot in our G-Wagons, but it's on the back here. We even got a tow hitch for all your fun, uh, I don't have the keys to unlock it, but got a tow hitch, got even a little bit of storage back there, got all your hookups that you need for water, sewer, etc. It's even labeled so you know uh, city and fresh water, even got a, an outdoor shower option um, if you want to like hook it up here. Everything you need, you can see blue efficiency, Midwest Automotive Designs helped with this. It's very clean, there's no missing pieces. You of course have that step up to work in the engine if you need to. And you can see up top a little bit, our air conditioning and satellite, everything that you need is all here. And it's not really it that big. So you got a full bathroom bedroom and everything so the one next to it right here this is a 144 and you can just see that they are pretty much the same 
is a uh, it's really impressive how much they can fit in such a little space. So I'll top back in here. We'll close up this door. It's pretty loud out there. We're right by the street, so just want to take a second chat with y'all. So this thing's incredible. I I love tiny homes. I love RVs. I think that they're great. You can see that it's more of a trend nowadays that people are buying spinner vans and converting them. And for some of you guys who don't really have the means or the place to build one of these out, this one's already done for you. And whether or not it's used as a, like a permanent home that you use, this is great traveling all around the United States or if you ship it to Europe or whatever you guys want to do with it. This is great. It's already done. You of course can put your touch on it, do whatever you want with it, but this is, this is really well done. I really love how these sprinters drive. They're quite simple. Of course, they're, they're longer than a normal car, of course. And so it's a little bit of a learning curve, but they're very comfortable. And I really love this. So I invite you to come down to the dealership. Come test drive it. Come tour it. Come open up every single cabinet and just ooh and ah over it. It's just a really fun uh, addition to anyone's collection or if you want to trade in your car and live in this this is a this is a really awesome option or of course we have a whole line of sprinters next to me here outside you can come take a look at uh the ones that you can either rip out uh, the seating or ones that are already don't have seats in them they're like our cargo ones come be fun come be creative uh, we have plenty of options here and we'd love to help you so come down to our dealership come check this out